He had fallen down the mountain, into the valleys and the pits and the abyss. He was ragged, torn, dirty, bruised. He had just lain in the mud. He accepted a fate not of his own choosing. While lying on his back, one word passed through his head. It passed through casually, quietly, almost unnoticed. Why? Why was he in the mud? Why was he in the dark? Why was this his lot in life? He began to stand. His legs were unsteady, unsure. They had forgotten. Memories of better days, of stronger days, flooded his mind. He imitated himself in times gone by, and he walked, walked forward, walked with increasing speed. Then he found it, the mountain. He was in the darkness. How could he climb? He looked at it with caution and fear. He looked back. Yet again, that word came forth in his mind. Why? His eyes hardened. His hands grasped the rugged mountain. His feet moved into the sharp rocks. Through pain, he found resolve. Slowly, he made his way. With patience, he went up. Soon, he could feel the first rays of the sun. Warmth, comfort, reason to keep going. The sky was blue. The higher he got, the more he could see. At last, the peak. From the top, he saw a horizon that seemed to go on into eternity. Eternal possibility. From around the mountain came a noise, and three women. They were all blind, holding a single eye amongst them, tossing the eye to each other. They put it in as they spoke. Abyss! 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 He came so far. The warmth, the beauty, it was his. No abyss. He caught the eye in midair and hurled the single eye of fate into the valley. The dark. The abyss.